a nice thing. Yes, yeah, a yeah. salute to him for that, huh? Yeah, yeah. very cool. That is very, very cool indeed. Uh, so were either of you out sky watching last night? No. I missed it. No. I saw it on I was social in media. <laughs> <laughs> Darn. I'll wait for the next 60 years. I told yeah, you, I've got the, it in my calendar. There you go. And I, I did see a lot of great stuff on social yeah, media. Yeah, they were cool. And we had a bunch of stuff sent into azfamily.com. There's uh, Jupiter and Saturn as they, uh, oh, it seemed like they touched. They didn't touch. They're millions and millions and millions of miles away. But uh, from our perspective, it looks like they touched. Um, here's another one, which is kind of interesting. Uh, right there, you can kind of see the rings around Saturn, but the exposure is so bright that we see kind of just almost looks like a, a star, if you will, for Jupiter. And then one more, which is a pretty good shot, Jupiter here with a moon, that's a moon from Jupiter, and then Saturn over here uh, with the uh, obvious ring shape. So our viewers doing a good job checking out the Grand Conjunction. Let's check out the Grand Arizona weather, if we will. How about that for a transition? Yeah, I nailed that one, didn't I? We're going to be in the low 40s tomorrow morning, about the same as we were this morning. Uh, tomorrow, a little bit cooler. I'll probably make it into the mid to upper 60s. We made 70 today, so just a tad cooler tomorrow. And around the entire state, boy, it's looking great. Sedona at 59, Lake Havasu 73, Pine Top 47. Flagstaff's also at 47 degrees. We would like to see some snow in those scenes. And we might see some early next week. We'll talk about that in just a bit. 70 are high, 45 the morning low. Average high is 65 degrees. At Sky Harbor right now, we're still at 70. The air is calm and the dew point is at 19 degrees. We've got 64 at Kingman, 50 at Sholo, 65 at Globe Miami, and 75 at Tucson. Uh, in the upper atmosphere, we're seeing some changes. We had a weak little weather disturbance move through today. Uh, we're going to continue to see that as we've got this area of low pressure up to the north of us that's pumping in some slightly cooler air. But guess what? Ridge of high pressure coming our way just in time for uh, Christmas Eve and Christmas will warm us up, bring us some clouds too. But it should be a pretty nice couple of days to end the week and then we've got a storm system that's developing the Pacific Northwest. It's actually this guy right here that might bring us a pretty decent shot at some rain and some snow by Monday into Tuesday across Arizona. So we'll be watching that storm very closely. In the meantime, future cast shows that it's just going to be quiet around here uh, through tomorrow afternoon. As we get into Thursday, we'll start picking up some high clouds out of the subtropics. No rain or anything associated with those high clouds. And uh, we will see uh, temperatures about average for this time of year. So the rest of tonight with clear skies, we're going down to about 45 degrees. Then tomorrow, it's going to be a mostly sunny day with a high of 68. Our extended forecast for you as we get into uh, Christmas Eve, high clouds in 66. Christmas Day, mostly sunny and 70. And after that, well, we're going to see temperatures coming down with that chance for rain by Tuesday morning. Very nice. Thank you, Royal.